This is Simona Rich and in this video I will cover some very important information about why people get certain results from the actions they take and how you can achieve much better results than you are currently getting. So set aside some time and really try to understand everything you see and hear in this video and if you become familiar with this information I can guarantee that your life will change and you will start getting much better results in life. Dr. Thurman Fleet created a simple but very important image of our mind. If you understand how your mind works and why you do certain things, you will soon enjoy better life quality because your whole thinking and actions will change. Now imagine that this circle is your mind and this smaller circle is your body. The mind shown is much bigger than your body because only mind determines what actions your body takes and therefore what kind of results you get. Your body has almost no influence on your results except for the action part for the body has to take action for you to get results. But the action quality is always determined by your mind. Therefore if you want to get better results you have to change your mind first. The mind has two parts. You have a conscious and unconscious or in other words subconscious mind. If you really grasp the concepts I'm going to cover here, your whole life will change very quickly. Your conscious mind is the mind that thinks. In this part of your mind, your free will lies. You always have plenty of choices and every day choices that you make determine the quality of your life. I will talk about these choices a bit later on. Because of this part of your mind, you can visualize, accept and reject ideas, opinions of others and other outside influences like your environment. The second part of your mind, the subconscious mind, does not think. It has no ability to accept or reject ideas offered by your conscious mind. It willingly accepts everything your conscious mind offers. If you believe that some idea is true for some time, this idea will be accepted by your subconscious mind as true. And this idea, when accepted by your subconscious mind, becomes a belief and such idea determines what habits you form and what actions you take. You will only take actions that don't contradict the idea that you have impressed upon your subconscious mind. So you can see that your subconscious mind controls your body because it determines what kind of actions you take. What usually people do is observe their environment and take most of opinions of others, be it opinions of friends, relatives, colleagues or media as true. And if they live in a good environment and are surrounded by positive opinions, then they are likely to be just fine because they take such ideas into their conscious mind, believe them to be true and therefore such ideas get into their subconscious mind. Those ideas in turn become beliefs, people form habits out of such beliefs and they take action that shows the belief that they have. For example, if your friend told you that people from India are very friendly and you would take this opinion as truth, it will soon get impressed onto your subconscious mind and therefore you will act according to such newly formed belief. You may become extra polite and nice with Indian people or whenever you would see them you would feel good inside. But what if you are surrounded by negative influences? Well, then you still go through the same process, you accept such negative opinions as truth, they form your beliefs and habits and therefore you act according to your beliefs. By now you should really start understanding why you are getting the results that you are getting. It's all to do with what kind of influences you choose to accept as truth. And those opinions that you accepted as truth may not be true at all. If you feel stuck as though you cannot improve your circumstances although you really try, this is what is happening with you. You are in an environment that has good and bad aspects. You may accept some of the good opinions and some of the bad ones. You may observe some of the good aspects of your environment like beautiful nature and friendly people but some of the bad aspects too like the crime in your neighborhood or the unfulfilled lives of your friends. When you observe such things and accept them then you believe them to be true so you let all these influences into your subconscious mind and that determines the results that you get in life. 
by observing everything in the environment that you do not like, you get the results that you don't like. Now what mostly people will do is that they look at those unfulfilled results and they let the results affect the way they feel. So when you look at the bad results you are getting and you feel bad as a result, you allow this bad feeling into your conscious mind which again confirms the negative idea you were holding and you again get the results that are negative. So because of that you feel that you cannot change your life. If you keep doing that, there is no way that you can achieve anything successful. But there is a way out of the situation, in fact two ways. You can select only those ideas, images and opinions from your environment that are useful to you. Before accepting anything as truth, always ask yourself, would this idea, opinion or image benefit my life or worsen it? And only accept it if it benefits you. If you see something or hear something that is negative, like if you look at poverty or hear someone complaining, simply choose to reject the idea or image by saying to yourself that is not true and seeing the opposite of that which you don't like. It is that simple to not allow the influences that are negative determine the results that you get. There is another even better way to get amazing results in life. You yourself have the ability to originate thoughts. Because you are a creative being, the only way you can effectively use your mind is by thinking rather than accepting and reacting to the ideas and opinions of others. Be in charge of your life and create the images in your mind that are pleasant to you. Visualize the life you want to live and keep seeing all your desires in your mind's eye until they become true to you. Your unconscious mind will gradually accept such ideas as truth and you will soon take the action that will manifest the ideas that you have impressed upon your subconscious mind. This is the best use of your mind. By using your mind this way you will allow the source to express itself through you and deliver to you everything that you desire. Thank you for watching this video. I hope that you now clearly understand why you sometimes get the same results over and over again. And I hope that you will apply this information to your life and start getting much better results.